if you do not want to install Oracle or SQL Developer in your computer, or don't have enough RAM or hard drive space in your computer. No worries. Oracle has its own online SQL editor. In this video, we will see how to use Oracle's online SQL editor for practicing SQL queries. Go to livesql.oracle.com. Click on Sign In. If you already have Oracle account created, sign in with your details, else click on Create Account. Fill in the sign-up form and submit the details. Oracle may ask you to verify your email account. After verifying your email account, come back to the sign-in page again. Enter your email ID and password then click on Sign In. After signing in, you can find the dark theme option in right top corner of the home page. I like the dark theme. Click on the navigation button for exploring various options. First option is SQL Worksheet. You can write and execute SQL queries here. Let me increase the font size. Let's create a EMP table with just two columns. Press Ctrl plus Enter button or click on Run button to execute the query. You can see, Table created, Output message. Save the queries as script. Now, let's go to the My Session tab. You can find your last 10 session details under, Previous Sessions. Check the tutorials you viewed earlier in Previously Viewed tab. Click on the Schemas tab to find the objects you created. I can see the EMP table we created in the beginning. There are a few default schemas here just like Scott and HR. You will have read-only access of all the database objects. Let's access the student details table from academic schema. Metadata about the table is also available here. Copy the schema name dot table name. Go to SQL worksheet and run the select query on the table. You can see the data from the table in the output. In this way, you can access the various objects from different schemas and do practice. In the My Scripts tab, you can find all your previously saved scripts. You can go to any of the your old script and run the queries again. If you are a tutor, you can create your own tutorials with the details including SQL queries. You can make your tutorials public or keep those private. In the Code Library tab, you can find all public tutorials published by different authors. Let's check this introduction to SQL tutorial. Different basic SQL modules are explained with the sample queries in this tutorial. Let's learn and run queries simultaneously. Click on Run Tutorial. Click First Module of Create Tables. Create Table Statement is explained in detail here. You can try to write your queries or copy code from tutorial using Insert into Editor button. I will copy the query and execute it using Ctrl plus Enter keys. Do not forget to save your sessions as script. If you need any help, you can check the help page from here. Important note. Oracle do not store database objects you create. Every time you sign in, you will get new schema assigned. You can access and rerun all your previous sessions and that's why saving sessions is important here. Thank you for watching the video. If you like it, 
Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and like Facebook page.